Race 7 is the David Nicholson Maiden Hurdle. And we've moved to Hereford now. We've got 9 in this one. 2.5 mile the trip. And Rabin Tantz is at the top for Padraig Hogan. 10 Arlo, Darren Thompson, City Underground, Jim Murray, Eman Oatway, James Shea, Gabrona, John Morgan, Gold Coast, Leon Van Rinsburg, Parisian Chief, Graham Clutterbuck, Shambolic, Paul Parsons, and Sierra Vista Sooty for Vinnie Gerard. A field of nine. And away they go. Heading towards the first flight. Two and a half miles the trip. They've probably got about ten to ten, twelve to take, so quite a few hurdles to get over. And the grey on the outside. Ten Arlo was just about to believe it now. Gold Coast has come through to take it up. And we are again at Hereford, the land of the electric fence. Stranger race courses in SO7. This as they get over the first of the 12. The electric fence on the outside of the track, which occasionally disappears. Oh, flight number two, they go. There's a four there. You don't see many fours in the hurdles, but Rabin Dance has gone. Uh, Rabin Dance may be put off by the electric fence, which now suddenly stops. So if you wanted to get into those little places down there, you could just walk round. Anyway. Gold Coast is in the lead. Ten Arlo is in second. The second strange thing about this Hereford track is the New York City skyline in the background. Which, if any of you have ever been to Hereford, will know it does not exist in Hereford. Anyway, over flight number three they go. They're all safely over it. And Gold Coast and Ten Arlo disputing the lead from Sierra Vista Sooty back in third. And a gap to Parisian Chief as they get to flight four. He's leading three have pulled away from the rest of them. City Underground, just a back marker. See Chimori back in the jumps. I think he had any jumpers last season. There's Ten Arlo in front. Gold Coast second. And then Sierra Vista Sutti is third. Gap of four lengths then to Gabrona, who's in fifth. And Eman Oakway is after that one as they get over number five. A really bigger crowd here at Hereford than we had at Taunton earlier on. Ten Arlo now takes it up, passing the winning post then a complete circuit of the track to go. Slightly bigger track as well. With Gold Coast second. And Gabrona. John Morgan in third. Sierra Vista Sutti is fourth. Gap of a couple of lengths then to Parisian Chief. City Underground on that one's outside. Then Eman Oatway for James Shaves. Already notched up his first winner of the season. And then Shambolic at the back for Paul Parsons, who's already picked up his first prize money of the season. And Gold Coast in front then from Ten Arlo. As they head to number six. Which they will get over. Okay. Past the shadow of the car park or whatever that is as they get over the seventh. Ah, oh, a mistake at the back there by Shambolic. I think that one shuffle out a shot. We get another look at the New York skyline. And it's Ten Arlo in front on Gold Coast. Oh no, that's not really the New York Scotland, but you know what I mean. Uh, Ten Arlo's in front. Gold Coast second, gap back to Gabrona. And then Sierra Vista Sooty. As they get over flight number eight. And the leading pair are still battling away for the lead. Ten Arlo and Gold Coast. Ten Arlo seems to be all keen on leading. Jump that one really well got away from it when I suddenly put himself three lengths clear inside the final five furlongs with just three more flights to get over Ten Arlo has gone too clear of Gold Coast in second Gabrona still looks to be going well in third so too does Sierra Vista Sotti Parisian Chief on the outside Eman Oatway is going to try and slip up the inside City Underground is Maybe just struggling for pace a little bit on the outside as they get over the third last good jump by the leading pair. It's Ten Arlo and Gold Coast who are clear at Ten Arlo. It's clear of Gold Coast by two to three lengths as they head down towards the second last flight. The great Ten Arlo for Darren Thompson over it in the lead. Jumps it nicely over it in second. Was Gold Coast the era Vesta Sooty is trying to close in third. So too is Eman Oatway but it's still Ten Arlo. One flight to take. Ten Arlo's in the lead. Leading by three lengths to Gold Coast in second. Sierra Vesta Sooty is third. Eman Oatway 
Tony's fourth, later down towards his final flight then now, and Tenalo is beginning to tie up Tenalo. Here comes Gold Coast on the outside. Gold Coast takes off and lands in the lead, but even better on the outside. Sierra Vista Sooty sweeps past the Gold Coast, and it's Sierra Vista Sooty who's gone on. Vinnie Gerard looks like he's got his first winner of the season over the jump. Sierra Vista Sooty took it from Gold Coast, and then Tenalo ended up only third. I thought I was going to win it in between the final two flights, but just couldn't get up the hill and Sierra Vista Sooty takes it for Vinnie Gerard. Gold Coast is second for Leon Van Rensburg. Emma Oatway for James Shea back in third. Gabrona for John Morgan fourth and ten on over Darren Thompson ended up fifth.